Namaste everyone. We are going to discuss about leprosy. Leprosy is also called Hansen disease because it is named after the discoverer called Hansen who discovered Mycobacterium leprae. So what is the causative agent Mycobacterium leprae? Source infected person, multibacillary person. Those who are infected means those who are suffered by or caused by your Mycobacterium leprae and mode of transmission is MOT is mode of transmission droplet infection prolonged contact if someone is if someone uh, someone is having leprosy disease from the same family and uh, same contact uh, direct contact will be there sitting living with him or her then the leprosy will occur 4 to 12 percent there is a chance but uh, we will consider a uh, direct contact. So, clinical features is hypopigmented patch on the skin with partial or complete loss of sensation, light touch. So, if someone is uh, suffered from leprosy, if it is in hand, the hand sensation is not feeling. So, we when we pinch in hand or in fingers, there will be no feeling of sensation. So, we call it as a light touch. So, and thickened superficial nerves, ulnar nerve will be affected in case of leprosy. WHO also classified leprosy based on extents of involvement of nerve or skin lesion. So, possibly less than 5 skin lesions and multibacillary more than 5 lesions. So, on the basis of lesion, we will prescribe the treatment. So diagnosis, split skin smear examination. So biopsy or skin split, wherever the part is not feeling sensation, light loss, we will split skin smear. Biopsy will be done. Okay. Lepromin test for hypersensitivity. Management CDI, clofazamine, dapsone, and rifampicin. Rifampicin is a drug which is also given in the case of TB. And prevention, BCG is found to be helpful. For 20 to 40 percent, because leprosy will also occur in child. So due to uh, this, the BCG vaccination will be done in children or in infants since birth. So it is helpful 20 to 40 percent. There is no specific vaccine available till now with leprosy vaccines. So early case detection and treatment will be beneficial in the case of leprosy as well as in tuberculosis. Note longest incubation periods of leprosy 3 to 5 years or sometimes 10 years will be also occurring. So, thank you so much.